Well, that didn't take long. That did not take long at all. Wow, it's pretty, huh? That is a pretty freaking fish. And there she goes. Oh. Every time I'm missing these fish. Why is that? Did I set the hook up again? There we go. I did hook it downstream that time. <laughs> Pretty wild brownies. Pretty wild brownies. He took off. Oh, there's one. Felt that. Slightly better fish. I tell you what, this Euro nymphing, extremely effective. I'm not catching big fish today, but I've only been here maybe 30 minutes and we've probably hooked into 10 fish, not landed them all, <laughs> but we've hooked into a bunch. And again, on the prints. Everybody likes the prints today, huh? Oh, these pretty little brownies, man. Oh, and the hook's out, sweet. Pretty brownies. Adios, brother. So these are the flies. I've got this, it's a Prince Nymph with a tungsten bead on the anchor fly. And I've got a little pheasant tail as the uh, dropper. So with Euro nymphing, I'm basically using really heavy flies. We used a lot of tungsten beads, we wrap a lot of lead on the actual fly itself. And the idea is we want these flies to go as low and slow as possible. We're trying as best to keep a straight line on it. There's another one. Trying our best to keep a straight line on it so that we can feel and see the fish as they hit. And the idea is a lot of fishermen actually go over the top of these fish when they're fishing because they're not getting down deep enough and they've got too much bend in the line and sway in the line that the, the flies are actually going over top of the fish. I don't even know how many we've caught today. It's been a very short stretch and we just keep catching them. Boy, they like that Prince Nymph today. Holy cow. Oh, one just rose down there. And we're getting them all. And these are all little wild browns. And they're all getting that Prince Nymph right in the tip of the nose. Adios, buddy. Oh, there was another one. <laughs> now, I have missed a few of these fish today. And a lot of it, I'm actually fairly new to the Euro Nymphing thing. And I'm setting the hook upward, which I should not be doing. Whenever you get a hit, you should be, I'm going to pretend I get a hit here. Or maybe I will, who knows. When you get a hit, you want to take it downstream like that. That way you're getting a better angle on the hook set. That's something I've literally just learned a little bit more about recently because I, miss a, I missed a lot of fish. And uh, since I started doing that, I've definitely hooked a lot more fish. Ooh, there we go. <laughs> that's right. I told you that's where it was gonna be. Freaking knew it. Freaking knew it. Oh. oh, okay. Well, had him in the right place. God, this is so effective. You get the right spots, man. You can freaking clean them up. Just got to keep one on. <laughs> that was a nicer one. One of the fun parts about the Euro Nymph thing is really taking your time and reading the water and really gently fishing each spot. And when you do, when you figure out, okay, that's my prime, prime spot for this particular hole, man, and when they're there, so rewarding. Gotta love it. The line stops, you set the hook, and there's a freaking fish. Again. Everybody wants the prince. Everybody wants the prince. 
Friends is starting to get worn out a little bit. The wire's coming off. Oh. Thank you, sir. Well, I went right back at it. Very next cast, hooked another one. Didn't have the camera on yet. This guy also seems to be fighting very well. Maybe slightly bit. I gotta loosen my drag just a little bit. He's fighting like a bigger fish. He won't give me his nose. It's all tails. He does not look like a bigger fish. Everybody wants the pr Oh my god, I got two! No wonder! Holy crap! I have two fish on. How am I gonna do this? I have never done this before. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, one. Oh, I can't even get one. Can't even get one. Don't lose them. Don't lose them. Don't lose them. Oh my gosh. Okay, first fish in. Where are you? Second fish, not in. Second fish. Oh my god, how am I going to do this? Okay, how's that? I got one on the print and one on the caddis. All right, this is a first for me. Using a tandem rig, I have two fish. One on the caddis, which took it good, and the other one, the prince, he looks like he missed and just got it on the side. Double release. Ha <laughs> ha! All right, so. Oh my goodness, how many fish are in this river that I just scored a double? Here's my flies. This is a tungsten prince nymph, what's well, left of it. This is a caddis that I just put on. And another. Fish are stacked in the fast moving water and we are just picking them off one after another. I mean, seriously, this Euronymphing is amazing. Wow, you guys are chunky. Look at the fat bellies. Fat bellies, fat belly browns. Oh, that might be a little better. I didn't feel him. He was just there. What's nice about these Euronymph rods is they're really long. This is 10 and a half feet and they're soft. So when I hook up this fish, even if you're using light tippet, they really protect it. Nah, he is bigger. He's bigger. Oh, wow, pretty fish though, right? Oh, baby. Yeah. Oh, these guys are just solid fish. Let's see what happens. This is where we get into trouble. Oh, thank you for coming out of there. <laughs> Man, you shot right, right out of where I needed you to go. All right, you're coming in, bud. Let's surf it. Surf it. You know, they're not long, but they are really nice, chunky fish. Ha. <laughs> Thought I had one there. Guess it was just bottom.
That's a fish. That's a good fish. Yep. That might be my best fish of the day. Yeah, maybe not even. Maybe not even. Again on the caddis. Got a little brown trout candy. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Man, you can catch them in fast water, you can catch them in slow water. God. They're almost orange spots. Wow, so pretty. So pretty. Let me tell you what. I have literally done this Euro nymphing thing only a few times now and Every single time I am catching fish in either conditions that I'm, I usually don't catch fish in or I'm catching way more fish than I ever would. I mean, this is absolutely crazy. So, so effective. Man, get out there and give this stuff a try. This is unreal.